but what is the real reason? So what I always suggest is going five whys deeper than whatever you wrote down. So why don't you want to be at the mercy of pharmaceuticals? Let's just play it out. If you're willing to do this with me, let's just do it together. Yeah. Why, aren't you, why, do, why don't you want to be at the mercy of pharmaceutical companies? Because you're having a, you having a headache doesn't mean your body doesn't need Tylenol or your body. And why do you think that's happening? Why are people taking Tylenol and ibuprofen when they have a headache? Because they don't know that the, there is, uh, there is uh, those, that's a syndrome. It's not the... It's not the cause. Yes, and why, why do they not know? Because they haven't been uh, informed. Why not? Because, um, number one, we have to have to come to this country. We have to 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 Mm -hmm. So, let's connect it now. So let's let's connect it to your why. Why do you? Where do you come into this whole picture? That because that was all great. That was all really really good, and that is in and of itself fantastic. But you're missing one part, which is your connection to that mission. Right. So for those of you that don't speak Spanish, what she just said was like, people come. To, Immigrants come to this country, they let, they, they let, they leave their food cu culture, they leave their food, the things that they're used to eating, and they just accept it as okay. But really, people then are getting sick because they're not eating well, basically. And then pharmaceutical companies come in and say, oh, well, it's normal, it's just, it's just what happens, take some pills. And she's saying, we've lost control of our health, of our, of our health. And we've let that part of our culture go while losing control of our health. So that's great. That's really strong messaging. Connected to me, to, connected to you now. This is the part, this is your, now it's time for you to build your brand. How do you do it? How do you connect it? You already, you already, show, you already said it, basically. Your personal story. So, so, do you see that, what just happened there? That's your why. That's your real why. Your good why is not to be at the mercy of pharmaceutical companies. That's easy. You can say that, people are like, yeah, I get that. But the last thing you just said, we almost lost our son. Like, my most precious, literally my most precious gift in life was almost taken from me because I believe so strongly in what I'm putting in front of you today. That's a very different why than what you started with. That's your story. Do you guys see that? Like, so all of, you, all of us, when we think about our whys, go that deep. Like, I'm, I'm sold. Like, I believe in you because you have now, it's one thing to say, like, I don't want pharmaceutical companies to, ru to, to, run, to run my life. It's a very different thing to say, I was actually willing to potentially lose my child because I'm so strongly for what I'm teaching you guys today. Totally different story. The, this, yeah. Yeah. Stakes have changed when that's the case. That's the real why.